Uh, we've got Western Hawks claiming that the Belt and Road Initiative is another imperialist project, just like the old Chinese tribute system. Uh, Westerners in the 19th century called it the tribute system. It wasn't the tribute system. It would neither collected tribute nor was it a system, but never mind. Um, and they described it as imperialist, and they see the Belt and Road Initiative as a continuation of the um, tribute system. I agree. The Belt and Road Initiative is a continuation of the tribute system, but not because of what they say, but because I don't think the tribute system was imperialist. I could go on, but I don't think it was. I think the Belt and Road Initiative is similar. It's trying, I mean, the tribute system actually created harmonious relations, peace. You had 500 years of virtual peace at a time when Europe was ripping itself apart in wars. Um, you had all sorts of things going on in, in harmonious ways. I see the Belt and Road Initiative as a continuation of that, but the West wants to demonize it, just like it demonized Chinese past. And if we carry on like this, we've got problems. The world has got problems. 